It's the kind of beat to go Hey guys, what's up? It's Joey, and today we're here for some more Survivor stuff, and I was scouring my world for something that I wanted to attack. I wasn't sure what I wanted to attack, and here's what I found. Montreal, a new battle popped up, and I'm like, why not? Let's attack Montreal. I haven't attacked it too much yet. I attacked it once just to kind of get a feel for the map, see what it had. It kind of had some fun. It has a lot of just um, harbingers, delivery men, things that just blow up. It's pretty random, but I had fun with it, so I thought, why not? Let's make a video on it. Let's attack some, get some Montreal gameplay in. Why not? So right now, I have a pretty fun little um, group right here. I'm kind of falling in love with the snipers and everything, because I'm having a lot of fun with the snipers, just kind of stacking them up all in uh, one pad, or kind of mixing two groups together, and just different types of snipers, and just kind of just going to town. So I've been having a lot of fun with that. So I'm bringing on pretty much all the different types of snipers, except for the lone wolf, I believe. I have a dead shot here. And I'm pretty much don't have a lone wolf, but I pretty much have every other type of sniper with me. I got deadshot, sharpshooter, regular snipers, and spec ops. Then I got the machine gunners with me. So we're going to be attacking this on expert. Let's defend that, and we're bringing along some desperados. It's going to be a pretty fun little attack right here. Just kind of mess around. I really enjoy it. It's a lot. I mean, I really highly recommend it. It's a lot of fun just to play with these snipers and just kind of just go to town with them. But right here, I'm going to send everybody back here. I'm going to bring... What? Not there yet. Not going to do too much there just yet. Now with this specific pad right here, this is where I'm going to be throwing down my two machine gunners and one sniper. Move them back just a little bit more. They're pretty much just going to be taking out people, taking out, defending this one pad right over there. Going to be looking at that. And then this other pad right here, this is where I'm going to have a little bit more fun. I'm going to keep three uh, mercenaries up front just to kind of keep the bulk of it down. Then I'm going to throw down some of my specialty snipers. I'm going to have a sharpshooter, spec ops, and a dead shot. I'm going to have one of each all chilling back here, keeping that pad at bay. You know, just having fun. And then if anyone does, you know, feel like running in, if uh, they see a little bit more people, they'll be right there to take out some people, some of those troops. And then right here, I'm going to use my desperados. I'm going to throw down all of them right here. I'll throw down some more snipers, uh, spec ops here. Just throw down the rest of my snipers here. And start on a dead shot. I'm going to move these guys up a little bit closer. Move these guys as far back as possible. And let's just throw down the last mercenary just to fill up that one spot. I'm going to focus in on that one area for the last little group there. But let's start it off and see how we fare. Speed it up a little bit. And we are off. Uh oh. Low battery. Just ruining the party every time. Alright, so right off the bat, we got a runner coming up. And we are not taking him out. But we do clutch it out. The machine gun is just turn it up right at the last second perfect but here we go we gotta take out that brute but other than that we're just pretty much handling these drones pretty well not too bad so we're pretty much just going to town right now pretty solid setup having fun with these snipers snipers are having a tough time getting those daredevils but they're managing to get them just barely so really our biggest problem right here are those mutated zombies but we're not having too many problems so here we go this is what i want to watch because this is a pretty sick little pad setup i have i have all the desperados a lot of different snipers. Fun stuff. Look at this. Just going to town. Snipers just going off. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Alright, where, where can I use this? Let's uh just throw it down. Mazdaf cocktail right over there. And we're pretty much just wrecking Montreal with this random setup. I mean, we didn't even have that. I mean, most of my snipers aren't even that high level. I mean, they're pretty low level, I think. But we're having fun. Looking good. Three stars. Getting that three game. Alright, so we got a paramedic. Fun stuff. I love it. Let's keep going. Let's try a different little setup. You know, actually, I want to try something. I want to try. Actually, they're not really high level enough. Let's see what what is it on easy? Normal eight. All right, I can do that. All right, so I'm gonna actually bring along all these contractors just because I've been wanting to try them out and see how they fare. Even though they're really low level, I'm gonna bring them all with me, and then I'm gonna bring some higher level troops just to help out cover their backs because they're not going to be doing too much damage but they are going to be stunning a lot of people which I, that's what I'm pretty much looking for, for from them and let's bring along a fire chief and I'm going to borrow this machine gunner from legion let's accept that go on easy contractors i am personally never really been a fan of them I really just I mean they stun zombies it's nice but I've really just had no use for them ever to be honest, just never really found a use for him. 
but today we're going to try them out and see what they can do. All right, so right here, this is where I'm going to put my mercenaries. But right here, this is where I'm putting all my contractors. So we got a pretty much full contractor setup right there. Pretty solid. Let's throw down hmm, three more contractors here. Two commandos going to town right there. And then for the final one, let's throw down a machine gunner to chill in the back here. And then the contractor is going to hold up the fort right there. And he might need a little help, so let's throw down some fire chiefs right next to him to help him out a little bit. Let's start these waves and get going. I'm really going to be looking over here because this is where I put like all my contractors pretty much. See what they can do. Well, I'm going to move these guys out of the way. Get away. I want to see what the contractors do. Look at that. Just stunned. Can't do anything. Mercenaries are like just in case. Okay, wait, I need them now. Yep, they came in handy, but the machine gunners. Look at those. The contractors just hit them, stun them. Nothing too crazy there. Alright, after a further review, I'm not going to be using contractors too much. I mean, I know they're level 1 and everything, but I just personally don't really like them that much. So. Yeah, go away. Machine gunner need, needed to spin up there, but didn't manage to get going. I don't know how my Mazov cocktail got launched over there. That didn't make any sense. Ugh, this is just going downhill, guys. This is going downhill fast. So they did touch the hospital. I mean, that's going to be an automatic two-star no matter what. It's a bummer, but let's see if we can get him back in the open a little bit. There we go. Got everybody back in the open. I'll probably end up being able to use a Mazdov cocktail to take out some people. They managed to take out one of the hospitals as well. Contractors are big. They aren't good. They get a zero. They are not good. I'm not a fan. Not a fan at all. Okay, so the drones decided to get off the hospital. That's interesting. Two seconds left. Didn't manage to finish off. And contractors are not good. Although they were low leveled. I don't, I don't approve. I don't put my stamp of approval on them. I'm not too excited about them. Alright, so let's get one more tech on Montreal. And I'm just going to pick randomly. I'm just going to randomly pick my... I'm just going to push the auto pick and see what I get. Defend. Update. Reset. I'm going to pick my borrowed unit first. Close my eyes. Auto pick. Accept. Did I get it? I did. What do I have? It's not too bad. I can roll with that. I mean, they're all high level, so I mean, I'll take that any day. Alright, so let's see what we have. Hmm, <laughs> Interesting, interesting. Alright, so right off the bat, I'm going to make this easy. Actually, it's not going to be easy, but I'm going to do it. Alright, so right here, I'm going to easily put a machine gunner right on the hospital, but I'm going to move him up a little bit further, so he'll be in shooting distance of that little pad right there. And then to keep people at bay, I'm going to throw down one commando. Throw him right there with a fire chief and a handy dandy paramedic. And I do have my uh, surgeon, so I'll be able to bring back some people to life. Might be able to stack some of these pads. That'd actually be really cool. So I'm going to put two fire chiefs, and then I'm going to put a machine gunner. And then I'm going to use my surgeon if I ever lose a fire chief, which I probably will right off the bat to a harbinger or something. Sadly enough. So let's start this off with a bang. Off they go, the fire chiefs to just go do their thing. And they did blow up the fire chiefs completely. Just completely wrecked them. This is where my surgeon is going to come in handy. I'm going to stim up this guy right here. So I'm really not focusing too much. What am I doing? I forgot about this area completely. Goodness gracious. That's embarrassing. It really is. Stim that up. Okay. So right now, we're just kind of hoping for the best. I want my surgeon to go bring those paramedics, or what am I saying? Fire chief back to life, but he doesn't want to do it. He doesn't want to hear any of it. Alright, so here we go. Surgeon, go bring back people to life, and sharpshooter. There we go. So now we have two surgeons, but they don't want to do anything. Go bring back. Thank you, please. This is bad. This is such a random raid. This turned so bad fast. Alright, so let's just throw down some snipers and machine gunner to help out a little bit. Flare. 47 seconds. Let's throw down a sniper back here. Take out some of those drones. And. Boom. 
finish it off with three stars or two stars. Not too good, but we still got it. So there we go. There you have it, Montreal. I'm going to be a fan. Montreal felt weird. I didn't like it. I don't really ever want to attack it again. Just one of those, just a weird little setup and group and not the biggest fan, to be honest. So, guys, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this gameplay of Montreal, and I'll see you guys later.